Morning guys, it's time for some new ideas. Um, but I also wanted to do another video that showed some settings. And one of the guys in the group was asking about the uh, STO volume indicator. And um, I wanted to highlight exactly what that is, what it does, and how it applies up here. So I think that's very important. And as far as the chart goes, as far as this chart goes, the only thing I have on is Bot Trader. All right. This is Reaper STO, and this is a tool I have not published yet. <laughs> but I'm working on it. Anyway, what I wanted you to see here is when the volume changes here and it triggers. These green arrows line up with STO, and they're alertable. So if you want to follow a trend change, that's the easiest way to do it. You can see it here. That's for trend changes. And here, based on what's going on with the trend. Same thing here. This is an awesome tool. But it's not alertable yet. But what is alertable are these arrows. So you can see that anytime there's going to be a trend shift, you can watch it. She follows it all the way down. Now, I don't have the bot set up on this just yet, so um, the bot signals are a little bit off. But um, these settings were really just to show off STO. Now, as far as the pack channel and the calls here, the calls here are spot on. You see, first candle, buy signal, sell signal, buy signal, sell signal. Weak trend, solid candle. Solid candle, solid candle. These are alerts. And I will, I, when I publish this tool, um, I'll give you what uh, a cheat sheet of what all the colors mean. But what I wanted to do here is I wanted to go into settings. This is a 15 minute chart. Change this to 15 minutes. I want to change this to 15 minutes. And there you go. You guys need to see that again. Slow down your screen. Okay. You always try, you always want to try and get the bot signal on the highest breakout candle which would be here. And here. And here. It's pretty simple. Um, and this is where the bot's buying and selling. This is not manual trading. And I have everything else in here turned off. Let me cancel this. Let me go here. Style. I don't want to see anything else. If the bot's running, I don't want to see anything else. These are the three I have ticked. Don't need that. That doesn't work. These are the trend arrows. These arrows. 
trend arrows. Uptrend and downtrend. And if you guys don't have it, then that means you don't have the latest copy of the tool. So delete the one you got and re-download the new updated file. I'm just going to go back up here. And if you want to test it against Holy Grail, that's all you got to do. Now Holy Grail is here. A lot of you guys jump in here and then you don't change anything. It will not run stock out of the box without you making some adjustments. You have to set the bloody tool up. Otherwise it won't run right. And that's what you got to do. And that's why I thought these signals, the way I would do a signals thing, just so you could see it. Um, the trend doesn't lie. I try and get the bot to buy before we get into the trend. Now, we've still got some pretty shitty volume going on, so that's not helping matters a whole bunch. Um, but, needless to say, that's where we're at. That's what we're doing. Um, so this is just a quickie video. I wanted you to see the new the, the, the indicator, how the bot's running, um, how to set it up, and give you some variables on how things happen. And you always need to watch the trend. If you're not watching the trend, you got your head up your ass. Manually trading, anyway. Um, bot doesn't care. Bot's just going to do what it's going to do. Um, if you want to do automated trading and not use the bot signals and just use the trend signals, well, you can do that too. So I said, I built this to be as completely modifiable as you want these signals are all in the bot tool so whether you want to use the reaper bot signals here or you want to use the trend signals that's up to you look at the chart adjust them see which way is going to fit your style of trading better that's what it's all about giving you the tools so that you can adjust your style of trading um, signals wise fees wise if you were to buy into this short here it's not going to trigger another sell until it gets all the way down here and it's going to flip and then it's not going to flip till it hits over here and it's going to ride down till it flips over here it's entirely up to you um, but, like I said, this was just a quick video, just a quick heads up. Um, I hope you find some value in it, and we'll uh, talk to you all soon.